Hi, my name is Chelsea. I'm an elementary music teacher from Cincinnati, Ohio, and this is my 10th year teaching. I've been vlogging my teaching journey for the past eight years, and within those vlogs, I sprinkle in my lesson plan content and sometimes like teach with me type content. I wanted to show you guys one of my favorite singing games for getting kids comfortable using their singing voice. There's also a lot of state and national standards hit by this. You're working on So and Me, you can do High Low. There's just so many different standards that you can hit with this one. But this is kind of how it goes in my classroom. I'm going to give you the whole uncut version of it. So I have a variety of needs, behaviors, all of those things. And hopefully this is helpful for you. This is my song and game teaching portion of the lesson of Doggy Doggy Where's Your Bone. up here and they're going to stand like this. I'm actually going to put this down because the kids keep accidentally touching them. Okay. They're going to stand like this with their eyes closed and everybody in the front row is going to make sure they don't peek. And then while their eyes are closed, everybody's going to have their hands behind their back. So show me your hands behind your back. Everybody. Because you're pretending you have the bone. But I'm going to hide the bone behind one person's back. But you're all going to pretend like you have it. Because then we're going to sing, Doggy, doggy, where's your bone? Someone stole it from your home. And this person is going to say, Who has the bone? And the person who has the bone behind their back is going to say, I have the bone. Then this person gets to turn around and take three guesses of whose singing voice they heard. But you're all going to pretend like you're holding it. Because if his hands are here, then I know he doesn't have the bone. So I don't know. Okay, here's my rules. Number one. Yes, number one, no cheating. No telling the person up here any hints or pointing or saying so-and-so has it. That's boring. No cheating or you're saying a timeout because that's boring. Number two, no pouting. Is everybody going to get a turn today? Yes. Maybe not. Maybe not. Are you going to pout if you don't get a turn? No. If you don't get a turn and you pout, are you going to get a turn next time? Yes. No. No. Because you don't want to get a turn. But hopefully everybody will get a turn doing something today. If we run out of time, we might play at the end of the belt. If we do not have time at the end of the belt, we'll play next week. And I'll make note of who did not get to do anything today. Okay, let's practice our song one more time. Doggy dog. Uh, doggy dog. Doggy doggy, 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 where's your bone? Someone stole it from your home. Doggy doggy. Ah, no, you're supposed to sing with me. Here we go. One, two, ready, here we go. Doggy, doggy, where's your bow? Someone stole it from your home. Then this person will say, who has the bow? And only the person with the bow will say, I have the bow. If you're not going to sing, then don't let me pick you. So if I tell you to come up here or I hand you a bow, but you're not going to sing, then tell me no so I can give someone else. Although... I don't think anybody here is very shy, so that shouldn't really be an issue. I'm shy. Yeah, right. Shy. Is it shy? Is it shy? Is it shy? You wish. I'm kind of shy. I'm kind of shy. Huh? No. Only 
the person holding the vote is saying, I have a vote. Chris Cross, I almost lost hands in your lap. We can do anything that's like that. Boys, do I need to split you up or can you handle it? Okay. Ask a good question. He says, the whole class singing I have vote? No, just the person holding the vote. Because the point is for this person to try to guess whose singing voice they heard. Make sure you use your singing voice because if you use your talking voice, it's a lot easier to figure out whose voice it is because we hear you talk all the time. We don't hear you sing by yourself all the time. So it makes it trickier. All right. Get up here and cover your eyes. Okay, you people, make sure she's not peeking. No peeking, girl. Do not make any reaction when I put it behind someone's back because if she hears you go, oh, or ooh, then she's going to know who I gave to try to be silent. <laughs> Remember you sing the first part. One, two, ready, here we go. Doggy, doggy, where's your mom? Someone stole it from your home. Okay, everybody hide it. You have three guesses. Turn around, open your eyes. Guess number one. Boy. 
That's always gonna have a really pretty singing voice, I bet. One, two, ready, here we go. Tommy, Tommy, where's your bone? Someone stole it from your home. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if it was helpful and subscribe if you like content like this or vlogs because that's mostly what I put out. But if you have any questions whatsoever, please leave them in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. I hope you're having a fabulous day wherever you are. Bye.